17. I am in personas with Ray here, who is the senior product manager, and he has something really, really cool to show us. So, I am going to give it to Ray. Hi, I'm Ray Tanson. As she said, I'm a product manager here at Personas. We're very excited to be showing the new Studio Live Series 3 digital mixers. So these are a brand new digital mixer that have been completely rebuilt from the ground up, an all new platform, an all new architecture. And we did a lot of really cool, innovative, groundbreaking things with these mixers. I'd love to show you a few of the highlights. So this is the Studio Live 32 in the new Series 3. So it has touch sensitive motorized faders, so as you navigate through your mixes, the faders are gonna move along with you. And they're touch sensitive, so it always knows when you're touching it. So you're not gonna fight, the faders aren't gonna fight you. Uh, you will also get the touch sensitive for when you're doing DAW control. We get the touch automation with the DAW control. It's a 32 channel mixer, and we have it set up to have 32 faders, so you have a one-to-one -one workflow. But you can do split layer workflows and layered workflows if you like. We, your right eight faders can be your auxiliary inputs. It can be your masters. So I've got my first eight FX masters. I can go over to nine to 16. Go over one more time. I have four fixed subgroups and my four FX sounds. I can also pull up my DCA masters here. You have 24 DCAs that you're able to use. I'm bring those up here. Those are going to control the faders on the left in a group. It also lets me spill them out. So I can just view what's in that particular uh, DCA. But even when I'm working in the layers, if I get confused at any time, I can just come over here and push the inputs button, and it's going to take me back to showing one of 32. So if I need to jump in a fader really quick, I can do that. Now, our mix buses that we have, we have a total of 16 what we call flex mixes. So when I have a mix bus selected, a flex mix means that I can have it be an aux mix or a subgroup or a matrix mix. So those are 16 of the flex mixes, any combination you want of AUGS, subgroup, or matrix mix. And in addition to those 16 flex mixes, we have four fixed subgroups. That's a total of 20 mix buses, not counting the four effects mixes, as well as your main left right mix. There's some other cool stuff we did with the fat channel. Again, like I said, this is a completely new platform, all built from the ground up. So we've got all new fat channel processing. I'm really excited about this one. This is pretty cool, check this out. So it's a new fat channel layout here. So if I go into my compressor, for example, uh, I can pull up my standard compressor, or I can pull up a tube compressor, or a fat compressor. Same thing on my EQ, I've got some options. I've got a four band fully parametric EQ, or I can go to a passive or I can go to a vintage. Now these are actual circuit emulated models of real outboard gear. And this is available on all 32 of your input channels simultaneously. The problem so is you don't have to limit yourself to only what the DSP can handle or just a few of them available here and there. You have all of these your EQ and compressor models available on all 32 inputs all the time. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. That's what we're starting off with. We've developed this platform with enough headroom in our DSP continue to grow the platform and add new features and functionality over time. Another really cool thing that we're excited about is our SD card recording. So we have built into the mixer full multi-track recording with SD card. So you don't need a YouTuber to do multi-track recording. I can go into my SD card, I can create a new session. When I create that session, it's going to open it up right here on the SD card on the mixer. So I can now do full recording. This is going to record 34 channels of uncompressed wave broadcast files to an SD card. That's all 32 of your inputs plus your main left right mix. Now if I record on all channels you'll see that on 32 gigabyte card that's going to give me almost about an hour and 45 minutes, hour and 40 minutes of recording time on a 32 gigabyte SD card. Now you could also if you want just select specific channels. So if I was only going to record my main left right mix, you can see I can get about 58 hours of recording time to a single SD card. Now this will also save the mix for you so you can recall and do a virtual sound check and bring the mix up that you had with you. And these files can be opened in any DAW. Of course they open easily in Studio One. The mixer comes with Studio One Pro. So that's the full version of Studio One. But it will also work with any other DAW on the market with us. Pro Tools, Logic, Cubase Nuendo, Ableton. 
And all of these tracks can be opened up in any of those dolls as well. In the back, we have a USB uh, for doing recording to a computer. We have 40 by 40 USB. We also have AVB for audio networking. The AVB for audio networking gives you 56 by 56 over a single ethernet cable. That can be used with a Mac computer as an audio interface with poor audio built in. You can also use it with third party devices. For example, we're uh, showing a preview here at the show of a Motu interface being connected over AVB. We also have a Wave Sound Grid interface connected over AVB. So these are previews of some of the AVB devices we're currently working on qualifying for interoperability with the next one. So you'll see a lot of this stuff as well as stage boxes and personal monitor mixes coming out from us later this year, all on the AVB network, all for the new Series 3 mixing system. So we have the 32 here at the show. We're also showing for the first time the 16 channel at the show. That's the Studio Life 16 channel Series 3. It's a smaller flame, frame, less built-in inputs and channels, but it's this full 32 channel mixer under the hood. So if you add a stage box to it, you can get the full 32 channels on the 16 channel Studio Live. So that's the Studio Live 32. That's available in shipping next month in February. And the Studio Live 16 will begin shipping around March, April timeframe.